Back at it, January the 25th, 2021. Uh, we're coming right back. Uh, we had a rough weekend. You know, they threw us a bunch of curveballs. And, you know, I'm going to keep swinging for the fans, man. I just got to time this ball and, and knock it out the park. And, you know, it's, the chance is going to come back around to get back up to the plate. And today is that day. Uh, we see the ESPN headline, uh, the main photo on the page. We see Kobe and Pal Gasol. Notice Pal Gasol is wearing number 16, and when you flip that upside down, it's a 91. Keep that in mind going forward. We're going to go over some things today. Uh, it's time for us to bounce back. This is what I call a bounce back day. Uh, you know, we can't win them all. We're not going to lo lose them all either. And with the law of the averages, you know, this is the law of nature. This is the law of the universe. You can't, you know, lose them all the time. You can't win them all the time. So we ran into that wall, and we, you know, we're going we're gonna to go through that wall and accept it and move on and you know stay focused on winning so today is january the 25th and the primary numerology is 67 for this day and that happens to be the 19th prime number and then 19 is the eighth prime number so keep this in mind going forward 31 it has a prime number of 11. uh 13 41 is the 13 prime number we know that the uh, coordination with that with kobe being 41 and his daughter being 13 uh, 47 is the 15 prime number, 11 is the 5th prime number, and then we have the 25th day of the year, which has a square root of 5, okay? And then we see the, the 340th day of the year, and, you know, so on and so on. So let's move up to Kobe Bryant, right? Kobe Bean Bryant, that's his full name. In English ordinal, the first cipher to the, in the left corner, 135 is one of the four base ciphers. We see his name equals 135, right? It's like, you say, well, okay, so what? And it's like, well, with them showing that photo on ESPN, you know, this is a form of communication and predictive type programming that I see. And the team that the Lakers are playing today is the Cleveland Cavaliers, and you have to look at the personnel because the last upset, that team did not have the personnel, man. Those guys look like some damn high school players out there. So Cleveland has beaten the Nets twice. And so they're more than capable. They have the personnel to get it done. And when we look at the Lakers' record, if the Lakers lose this game today, they'll be 13-5. and five, And then they will be 9-1. and one. And then we also know that 91 is the 13 triangular number. And there's a 13-day numerology. Right? And then 91 is the mirror of 19. You see the synchronicity there with the record of the Lakers? This is a very strong read today that I that I found. It's a big fish. Uh, the line is, you know, kind of telling the story for me because now the line is at $531. What a joke. The Lakers could go 13 and five and the line for that to happen is plus 531. And you telling me that that's not something that you would want to put something on? Come on now. But don't put money on this game. Don't put up your money, just, you know, observe and see what happens.